first thing was was music because he he started the, about the age of five, right? But I think yeah. you. I was more mm -hmm. nervous doing that now than I was going out for for a game. You know, music was kind of at the heart of that, where it kind of kept us all all together, I suppose, and all all in at alone as well. So. I started this man here on the fiddle and on the accordion. Yeah, you whistled yeah. into my ear, didn't you? That was so. <laughs> <laughs> and I tried to copy back. It was taught to Billy Henshaw. Yeah, I, the I Billy. whistled yeah. everything. Whistled everything, yeah. And my father taught me the fiddle at eight. No, he didn't know how to play it either, but he taught me it. Figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I should have taken out some kind of a pattern on it. I could have made money out of that. <laughs> Obviously, we've a, a big family, and it kind of keep kept us close to our cousins as well, because we'd always, um, you know, anytime we'd meet up, we'd always, you know, have sessions and stuff. So I think music was kind of at the heart of that, where it kind of kept us all, all together, I suppose, and all, all in at alone as well. So my father, he was from Dublin, and he was from a family of kind of musicians, and I suppose I got a bit of that from him. Robbie got a bit of that down to Tony and I. We love him to bits tonight, <laughs> it's as simple as that. He started with the fiddle yeah. and then all of a sudden he had an accordion. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, um, yeah, mm. it's great. And Emily, you were the same, you started yeah. with, what, what did you start with, the fiddle as well? Yeah. And then you moved on to the yeah, progressive the fiddle. Yeah. Yeah. Did a bit of dancing as well, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh yeah. Rob used to play in the kitchen, Dad would be playing the guitar and I'd be practicing my jigs or, you know, feet like fireworks. Yeah. I was never any good, but he used to tell me I was brilliant. Keep yeah. going. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, whenever we went away, like, we... Yeah. Granddad always told us... Yeah, his famous words, he's like... Yeah. Oh yeah, it's fuzzy. Wherever you go, make sure you bring, you bring your, your instruments. Bring your instruments. You'll yeah. never, what did he say? You'll never be out of pocket. <laughs> you'll always meet yeah. someone. You'll always meet people. people open up doors for you. Me a lot of my of my own family, like it was just music, completely mm. focused on the music the whole time, and and it's it's fantastic yeah. for 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 the whole family, and um, yeah. like one of the girls was saying, it the the, the love for it is what yeah. what keeps what keeps you, mm. um, you know, keep keeps it up really. Yeah. His first start was on the set. You were seven, I think. You were seven. Uh, first start playing rugby. Yeah. Bucks. Yeah, yeah. Under seven. Yeah, and yeah. And Dad was coaching me. And he used to be out in the garden with me, holding <laughs> a fender, and he'd, he'd be practicing it as his, his side steps. So yeah, we lived in Kilmeny now. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I was only young back then, but yeah. I was the one who was standing, or he'd be kicking. I never the tackled ball. you though. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I, could have yeah, yeah. I remember that those early sessions. We'd sit them down here in the circle. We'd be all from three, four, five, eight, nine years of age, the whole lot of them. And the scratching and scraping would come out of it. <laughs> <laughs> you drive the crowd nearly out of the place. <laughs> Some young kids can show huge talent early on and fade away. 
but you you just seemed to peak at the right time Robbie yeah, yeah. At the right. <laughs> and then from there you just progressed but he's not finished yet 